Welcome to uh, Vibor International Billboard Painting Festival. That's My name is Anders uh, Ravendlov and uh, we are here now and uh, all the artists are uh, starting to get here. And uh, this event uh, in Vibor is now the third year in a row. But this year we have a special um, special uh, hook on it. You know, uh, we have invited some of the most uh, famous and uh, <laughs> most legendary graffiti writers and uh, mural painters in the world. And uh, that's amazing. It's a dream come true for me to uh, be able to connect the uh, two uh, part of the world, uh, like Brazil and uh, and Bronx, New York, and Sao Paulo and Bronx, New York, uh, here in Vivo. That's a once in a lifetime experience. So come and see it. But you know, I'm from Brazil, and so I never leave the house without my gun. So. I was circulating around, looking at each art, and as I said, I saw Anders over there drawing a picture, and I said, I bet he's not Brazilian, and I, I'm going to see, and I went over there, and I said, he's drawing, and that's what I would do if I were at a place where I didn't speak the language <laughs> and I asked him, I think first do you speak English? Yeah, yeah. And he said yes, and so we yeah. started talking, then I invited him to see my work. And now we're here in Vivo. Yeah, it's we're fantastic. Here, but, you know, <laughs> I was saying to everyone, I say, you know, I'm going to tell international bankers to invest in Denmark because you spend a few hours with this guy and he gives you a plane ticket coming and going and hotel and food and drinks and exhibitions and wow, what a return! <laughs> My name is Blade from New York City. I started doing graffiti in 1972 and I'm here in Vivborg uh, promoting the festival through Anders who helped organize it. We're torn kill of the NB Gallery and this is a very great event and they should have people come out to promote and do this each year because it brings people in from all cultures uh, to show support to the arts. And I uh, thank you for the support that you're bringing to the city of Viborg. What are you going to do with this billboard? Uh, on this particular billboard here, I'm going to paint my party time character pan down to the... Uh -huh. And he pans down to the... Thing. I do this a lot. <laughs> and I'm going to actually put this on the billboard and, uh, and then I'm going to donate this to the city of uh, Denmark and Viborg uh, so for the future uh, and hopefully they will put this in galleries and museums and preserve it for the next uh, hundred centuries. Yeah, yeah. That's amazing, you know, the things that you can
tell there? I can't believe what he's saying. Oh, 75 years of history. Yeah. It's like, like yeah. the Mr. Hello, Anas. Hello. What are you doing? Preparing my number two billboard. What kind of billboard is it going to be? It's going to be, uh, I don't know if you can call it simple, but it's going to be more like a one, one kind of uh, motif, only with a person in the middle of a black forest that is going to eat a hot dog. And this person is uh, like um, a person that we know from the Danish culture. The Danish art world, or the Danish art history. Okay. He's going to stand in the middle of a black forest. And okay. He's going to eat a hot dog. Det er et lidt spændende projekt, jeg har aldrig prøvet det før. Det handler de steder om den her, som er en vinduesvisker til en bus eller en lastbil. Og øh, den skal ligesom viske motivet, som jeg vil male, det figurative motiv i mit maleri, væk. Eller frem, kan man så sige. Øh, lidt spændende, der er nogle tekniske udfordringer, men øh, jeg tror på det. <laughs> Okay.